Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Hagecraft PvP. Today I'm going to be starting off in admin mode because I have a few things I want to talk to you guys about and also a few things to announce. So let's get straight into it here. The first one is that we have finished the King of the Hill plugin. That is right guys, we have finally finished it and we were running it for about 12 hours on the Hagecraft PvP server just before I'm recording this video and it was going fairly well. Everyone was enjoying it, they're all running to the hill, it was 24-7 PvP and we decided to take it down and do some minor adjustments to make sure everyone is happy and while I'm doing those adjustments I thought I'd make this video to ask you guys what you would like in the comment section below. So that way you can decide how often you want the hills to run, what loot you want in the hills, and any other hill adjustments you think you might want, like should we have one hill, two hills, five hills, 10 hills? You guys have to tell me because it drastically changes how you play the game. Because if there's a hill every five minutes, no one will ever go to like the back of spawn. Everyone will always be running to the hill to get the good loot. So that's why I'm thinking we do a hill every hour or two, maybe three even. And in that hill, we put some amazing loot, like a full god kit and a god apple. So it's a good enough kit that everyone will want it. They will come here every two or three hours, and there'll be a massive fight. That is my personal suggestion, but you guys tell me in the comment section below what you guys want. And I'm also thinking two or three hills. So two or three hills, two near spawn and one further away from spawn. Um, the good loot, the god kit and the god apple, spawning every two to three hours. And yeah, that's my suggestion. You guys tell me what you would like though in the comment section below. At the moment, the hill we have set up is this one here, King of the Hill this way. And every, it was happening every like hour, I think it was, when we had the test thing going for about 12 hours. And you just had to stand in this red wool for a few minutes. We can also define that. So how long do you reckon it should take to cap the hill? Should it make, should we make you stand in here for 10 minutes? And then if you're holding this red square for 10 minutes, then the chest will spawn and you get the loot. But then if you die, you gotta run back in here and stand in it for another 10 minutes. So I'm reckoning, I think, one or two or three minutes standing in the hill is good. But you guys can tell me what you think about that as well. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Tell me what you think about all those different hill options. Um, whatever gets the most support in the comment section below, we will set up on the server and there will be some awesome King of the Hill PvP action going on, which will be a great addition to the server and I personally reckon it'll make the server 10 times better if there's constant PvP action. So there you go, that was the first little, little announcement. The second one is, for all of you who watch my videos, my live streams, or just want to PvP, I have a big event coming on at tomorrow morning my time. So I'm uploading this video. It'll be uploaded around 11 or 12, or maybe even earlier, or 10, my time on the Saturday. And I'll be doing the live stream the following day in the morning on Sunday. So Australian Eastern Standard Time between 9 and 11 a.m. is when I will start live streaming. I'm going to be giving away tons of ranks. I'm going to be doing massive PvP battles. I'm going to be doing like tons of random giveaways. I'm going to be announcing special events and other things for the future. Uh, T-shirts, all these cool stuff. So make sure not to miss out. I'm even going to be playing mini games. It's going to be an intense live stream. So if you want to be involved, then make sure to check out my Twitch TV link. I'll chuck it up on screen now. It'll also be in the description below. Go ahead and follow that channel so then when I go live, you won't miss out. And yeah, that'll be tomorrow, Australian Eastern Standard Time. That is really late at night for Europe, like 11 or 10 at night or 12 even. And it is the middle of the day for US, like 5 p.m. or something like that. That's a general idea, but look it up for yourself so you don't miss out. And bam, they're my two announcements that I had for you. Now I'm gonna be going out of admin mode. There we go. So I'm back to normal player mode. I gotta go out of vanish, but I'll stay vanish just for now so people don't know I'm on the server and spam me. I do have to stay vanish because I do get a lot of spam, guys. I'm sorry. And I don't want it spammed up with r rude words and stuff in chat because people tend to do that and they're pretty dogs. So here we go. Let's go check out my home, see what's the latest with that. Um, looks like I still need to do some work on it since last episode. And I'll probably, I'll finish that up this episode actually. Looks like we have a nameplate over there. Who is that? We've got a visitor. 
Hello, friend! Or maybe enemy. We may have to tread carefully here. I don't know what we're up against. Oh, what are we up against? Is it a guy in diamond? It's a guy in iron. Take him out! Take him out! Surprise attack! <laughs> Surprise attack, mofo! Oh, I'm in vanish! <laughs> My bad, bro! My bad! <laughs> Let's message him! My bad, bro! <laughs> I was invisible, I would have killed him for sure, though. <laughs> I'll give him a shout out for that, there you go, man. I just, I felt like jumping you, I didn't want to kill you though. <laughs> we'll go back to my base. I've screwed up the admin command so much, guys. I'm sorry for that, but I, I'm, I'm the fairest person on the server, let's be honest. Everyone else would have killed him right there. Everyone else would have screwed him over, but I'm, I'm the nicest bloke going around. So there you go, we'll save, we'll spare his life. He said he's claiming the, the plots around me to protect my base. Thanks, man, that helped me out even more. That's what you can get your friends to do, claim near you so it's all safe. And yeah, there we go. We've got people spamming already. That's permute this guy. He deserves a permute. See you later. No, thank you. We don't want you on the server. I should just ban him, but I'm not going to ban him just because a mute should do for now. But if I see him trying to abuse anything else, he's definitely banned. All right. So to finish off this base, I'm going to go buy some more obsidian back at the shop. I'm going to come have a look. Is there any signs around that anyone put any signs down for me? No signs this episode. Everyone hates me. Now there's some over here. Let's see who built this. Oh, look at that. Jamie blew your flowers up. Thanks, man. And an advertisement, which you can check out if you really want to, guys. <laughs> All right, what else have we got? We got some people. They still haven't built their plot. These guys haven't built theirs. Uh, not much progress going around. We'll have to make our own progress. Back to spawn. And we'll head into the shops. And we'll buy some materials. Oh, I can also do a little drop party. There you go, guys. Drop party for everyone. Yay. This was from the King of the Hill. When I ran in, there was like a hundred dead bodies there. It was an absolute bloodbath. It was a major PvP hotspot. All right. Obsidian. Yes, we need quite a lot of obsidian. Let's just buy quite a lot of it. We'll get two stacks, I reckon. There we go. That'll do. And... Do we have any... What did we put in our ender chest? I forgot. Oh, we don't have the buckets of water. Where were the buckets of water again? I remember it took me four years to find them. I think they're down the bottom. Slash feed. Nice little donator command helping me out once again. Thank you very much. Um, water buckets, water buckets, water buckets, water buckets. I think they're over here. Neg. Negative. Negative. They were not there. Negative. Negative. Okay. We don't need water buckets. I was just kidding. We're going back to the base to place this obsidian. All right. Slash home home. There we go. Now, to finish this base off, we are going to just chuck obsidian there. Pretty simple. I might need a door. Should I put a door in? I think I might need a door, to be honest. Um, no, I don't need a door. Do I? I'll stay on the outside for now, because I'm going to close this in. I won't be able to get in without using my set home now. Now that it's fully closed in and without a door, the only way in is to use my home. So, there we go. Now I can't get in. <laughs> Not that useful, but it, it does protect your base. It stops them from boo, stops them from being able to kill you. If you if you can't get in, they can't get in. Ten. Oh, I put that sign there. I thought someone else put that sign. I was about to go what? All right. So there we go. To make it even more protected, you'll just do layer after layer after layer after layer. Just keep doing layers. The reason why I did the layer that far in is because when you place TNT on the side, TNT can explode four blocks. So one. Well, they can place blocks here where they dug the hole. So one, two, three, four. And then I have the obsidian. So then people couldn't just place it right there on the side and then hit destroy my wall. They actually have to use a TNT cannon now. So it wastes double their TNT. It doesn't mean that much on this server because it's pretty easy to afford TNT, but it does make it more expensive for them. So that's why I did it. And there we go. Now, for some PvP action, like usual, going through all the all the fun stuff now, it's time to kill some people. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go slash ender chest, put away all my goodies for now. I'm going to go slash spawn. And then, we're going to go into the PvP zone and see who we can kill. We're not going to tell anyone, but... Um, we're just going to jump in, because if we tell anyone in chat, we will get ganked and killed instantly. So, that'll be no good. But here we go. Drink this up. 
Let's jump into the PvP zone, see who we can find to kill. There's someone over there. I've got my bow in a weird spot, but here we go. We're coming up on him. He's... Oh, he knows I'm coming. He's legging it. He's legging it. He's legging it. He's dead. <laughs> he wanted to team, but it was too late. If you, if you see a bull charging at you with a sword, you can't surrender when he's just about to hit you. It doesn't work like that. Who is that? What armor? He's wearing half armor. We can take him out. Does he know that he wasn't wearing a chest plate? Oh, enchanted armor. We're gonna... Oh! He had a lot of good stuff on him. Maybe we should... We'll donate to whoever comes in here. Here you go. Whoever comes in here gets all that stuff. Ha! Huh. Oh! We got more incoming. We got a guy in diamond incoming. Oh! The dogs. They're gonna kill... Look at him. He's coming in with full P4. And kills me in iron. These guys, these guys. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm going to head over to some 1v1s now. Because I know you guys love the 1v1s. And I'm trying to do as many as possible. Because everyone is messaging me going, Hey, do I want a 1v1? You Can we 1v1? And I've got to try and do as many as possible. So I'm going to jump out one more time. And then cut to some 1v1s that I find. This guy's spamming me way too much. There you go, man. I'm sorry, I have to kick you from the server for spamming. Alright, off we go to the next one. What do you, you want some, bro? He's drinking a potion. Oh, come on, get some good hits. Yes! <laughs> that guy was didn't know what was happening. He, I think he was trying to, he was in his inventory for the first two seconds. And then he got out of it, and then he just died. So, unlucky. We've got a whole bunch of people following us. Let's just go up here, into the castle. Hopefully we can take them on one by one. That's our only chance, really. Die! Oh, no, yes! I made him fall! Run! <laughs> I'm on one heart now, though. I don't stand a chance unless I get some crazy good combo. Come on! Come on! No! Someone got a hit on me. <laughs> See what I mean, guys? The PvP zone is very intense. Especially if you're a target like a YouTuber, because they all know you're recording, and they want to go after you. <laughs> Alright, now we got to mute another guy. What is with the people in chat today? Not being very friendly. Have to mute them all. Alright. Anyway, we're going to cut the video till I find a 1v1. Don't forget, guys, come check out the server. It is absolutely amazing. If you want a 1v1 me, chuck a comment in my video. And then if I see you commenting and I see you on the server, I'll try and prioritize me messaging you asking for a 1v1. It'll help me um, pick some people that are subscribers because I'd rather pick the people who are supporting my channel the people like you guys who are watching it right now Liking subscribing anything that helps me. I'd rather be picking you guys So tell me in the comment section below and see right there. I know he watches my channel. Let's try and set up a 1v1 with him Yeah, man I will have to go vanish to set up this 1v1 because otherwise um, people will jump down and interrupt But I'm gonna fly around somewhere and then set up this 1v1 for him off we go. We'll do the 1v1 right over here. This looks like a good spot. It is where we did it last time. <laughs> Yay! 1v1 spot for the win. TP, MO, 2 Hades MC. So if you ask me for a 1v1, I am going to TP you, so make sure you have all your stuff off. And Nitro is asking for me to stream. The good streams tomorrow. Hopefully he watches this video so he doesn't miss out. I do need a bow. Oh, I don't, I'm not wearing any armor. Slash kit. Archer slash kit archer and I'll give myself slash kit PvP kit There we go. All right all fair all good to go chuck this on get my bow ready go out of vanish go out of game mode and Hope I think he watches my video show so he should know the single the signal for going the like the start signal Which you guys should all know as well if you're watching this video. I'll go over here. You see him hopefully get his attention Three, three, two, one. Go, 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 go. That means go. I should have, I was just, I missed on purpose, by the way, guys. That was a warning arrow. Why would he jump off the tree? <laughs> weird guy, weird guy, weird guy. Let's jump behind him. Come on, get some good shots, get some good shots. Yeah, that's what I call a gank. A tree gank. And he's down. Hades one, watch your mouth to zero. This is, of, of course, a best of three like usual, guys. And so far, I am undefeated in the 1v1s. And I have versed two donators and a member so far. So, let's see how well I can go and how long I can go until I lose. 
This will be very interesting, but we'll TP him back. We will drop down his armor. We'll drop down a bow for him. We'll also drop him some arrows. Did I pick that up? Nope, he picked them up. Okay, very good. We'll slash feed ourselves to heal ourselves back up. He says sorry. He's got a... Does he not have a sword? Oh, he needs a sword. <laughs> Lucky I didn't start the fight without giving him a sword. There you go, my friend. Let's begin this epic battle. This one will be a bit more interesting because I think he won't jump off the trees this time. It's definitely a disadvantage to jump off the trees. Three. I'm just writing three and then doing this. Two. One. Go. Go, 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 go. Oh, he knows. He knows the signal this time. Huh. What? How did he hit me with that? Yes, I knocked him off the tree. Oh, no, I just knocked him further down. Oh, what a hit. That was an epic shot by Hades MC there. I need to turn up my volume, though, because I didn't hear the dinging sound. And that's actually really good. Oh, that was a dog arrow, I'd almost say. Oh, why did I jump there? I took extra fall damage. I took a needed fall. Oh, it was worth it, though, to get behind him. I thought I screwed that up. I shouldn't have jumped off the tree. I should have just fell. So then I wouldn't have taken any fall damage. See then? I didn't take any fall damage. But when I jumped, bam, it takes me down two hearts. That's a big difference. When you only have ten hearts of health and you jump down and take two, that is definitely a big disadvantage. But I did get the crits in. And I got him from behind with that jump, so I think it was worth it in the long run. We'll TP him back here though. Chuck him back his armor. There you go, my friend. Oh, am I, am I picking that up? Nope, he was picking it up. Very good, very good. Let's feed once again. I'll jump over here. And oh, I have to regen some hearts before we start this one. Hopefully he doesn't start. Oh, did I not give him a sword? I keep forgetting the swords, guys. You know, here's a sword broke. Don't... I thought he was going to start attacking me. As if he wanted to take me on without a sword. This guy's crazy. He's a ruthless killer. He murders people with his bare hands. <laughs> Ready to go. All right. I'm just going to heal myself up here. There we go. Oi! Oi! He's going for the shot. Ready? One, two, three. Go. He's already shooting at me. Wow. All right, we're going to keep going. We'll, we'll count that as part of the 1v1. It's a dis disadvantage for Hades this time. Let's see how he plays this. What? I shouldn't have missed that, guys. I shouldn't have missed that either. What? Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Come on, you got to get back on the trees, man. Camping under trees is not the way to go. Come on. Come here. Come here. What do you think you're doing, man? What do you think you're doing? Think you can kill me? Look, I'm crouching so he can't see where I am. He was crouching then for a second, I think. Oh! Oh! Die! The backward swing! Yeah! One heart aids wins the fight! <laughs> GG. Good game. Mocha mouth or however you pronounce your name. I've got no idea. That was a good fight, man. I've continued my winning streak. I'm very happy about that. Who can we verse next is the question. Diamond Digger is an elite. Let's give him a shot here. Diamond D. Hey, man. 1v1 question mark. Can I have your head at least? No, you did not get my head for losing three times in a row. Nice try. Alright, we'll TP this guy here because he seems like he was pretty eager to fight. TP Diamond D who hates MC. And that rhymes because we're sick. We're fully sick, bro. <laughs> Alright, there he is. What's he got? Has he got everything? Yep, he's got everything. He's got his bow. Boy, you're shooting at me already. What is this? What is this guy? He obviously doesn't watch my videos, he doesn't know the rules. I'm going to feed up here. One, two, three. Go, 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 go. Huh. Huh. That was a good shot by me, you have to admit. Come on. Oh, and he hits him again. I wasn't undercover there. i got to get undercover. There we go. He's coming at us, so we're gonna come at him at a quicker speed. Get behind him. Get over the top. He didn't see that coming. Oh! Yeah! GG! Hades 1, Diamond Digger 0. Time for round 2. I got another head. I'm getting a collection of heads. <laughs> we should put these up in my base somewhere. 
I, oh, I forgot to collect them from the last people's heads. I should be collecting all of them, shouldn't I? I'll start doing that from now on, and we will put them slash ender chest. We'll put them in the ender chest so we can see all the people we've beaten. Um, I do I do understand I've missed a few, but we'll start from now. That'll be a good little head collection. Um, is the guy here? I know you can't see till you walk out of the chunk, so we won't be able to see until he picks that stuff up, hopefully. I heard him picking the stuff up, so he's here. We'll jump back over to these this side of the trees to start the battle. There he is. Wait till he puts on his stuff, and we will go again. Come on, buddy. Chest plate. Oh, Hades forgot the chest plate. Okay, I'm coming back over to give you a chesty chest plate, that is. There you go, my friend. And I don't know, but you can take Macha Mouth's gear when he died several times. <laughs> oh, wow, that's so mean. He did good, though. He did good. Everyone's been doing good in these PvP battles so far. I am, of course, I play this game all day, every day, so I should at least be better than half the people on here. Oh, I forgot to do the thing. One, oh, you little, two, three, go, 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 go. I gave him the signal. Oh, he shot the first arrow. Hades hits the first one, though. He's going for a jump shot, jump shot. Oh, I took major damage from that fall. We got to play this smart now, because we're at the disadvantage. We are way lower on health than him. Yeah, we see him, though, and he doesn't see us. That's our advantage now. Oh, no! I missed! I missed! He should have taken... He should have taken that advantage and attacked then. Because that was his main chance to get a kill on me. Now I've got a chance to reposition. Oh! Make sure I don't get hit by any arrows, though. See, now I've got a chance to run away. He had the health advantage. He should have taken advantage of it. I said advantage four times in one sentence, but... YOLO! <laughs> Alright, jump shot! Shoot down there. We, we see him crawling. We sneaking. We shooting. We jumping behind. And we jumping down. Come on! Get the crits! He's in the water! Get another crit! I need a crit in the water! Yes! GG, good fight. We got ourselves another head. So we've already won this because it's best of three. So, um, I've technically already won, but we always do three battles no matter what. Just to make it fair on everyone so everyone gets a chance. We'll TP him again. TP him back. We will heal myself up. We will chuck down all of his stuff this time instead of forgetting something. And I, we seem to be getting lower on arrows every time. Um, that, oh, well, look at me fall down here. Oh, well, I'm just going to hit this block out using elite admin powers. Come on. Come on. Okay, ten minutes later, because I was in water there. But I decided just to sink to the bottom, because, you know, you know whatever. No one can be bothered with that. Alright, here we are. Back on the trees. Jump up here. Oh, wow. Hades, number one jumper in Oz. He's running straight at me. What the... Hang on, we got to do the signal, man. The signal. Up here. One, hey, look. Look, signal. He doesn't care in the slightest. Look at him. He's just like, I'm going to kill Hades this time. <laughs> That's all he's thinking, I can tell. Look. One. Two. Three. Go, 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 go. Does he see the go? He must see the go. He's coming at me. So, there we go. Yep, he charged up an arrow first. Oh! I somehow deflected the arrow! Oh! Hates the beast! The legend! He kills him with a bow! In consecutive shots! That's what I'm talking about, guys! That's how you play the game. That is how you play the game right there. Slash into the chest. I'm going to bank that head. We went all six for six matches today. I am very happy for that. I'm going to try and do at least two 1v1s per episode. And as you saw, these were just two random people from chat. Well-known players on the server, both donators. And he just says, man, you're sick at PvP or I am shit. Bye. I gotta go. He's out of there. <laughs> Thank you, man. Shout out to you. You're the you've been you've been added to the um what's it called? The head selection that I have in my ender chest. So I would like to thank you all. And as always, guys, I have a few things to wrap up this episode with. One, check out the stream, which is tomorrow between 
Oh, this is the start time. The start time is going to be between 9 and 11 a.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time on Sunday the 11th. I mean, Sunday the 5th. So that is tomorrow. Make sure to check that out. If you see this video is just uploaded, who knows, I might be streaming. So go check out my Twitch TV slash Hage TV. And you'll probably see me streaming, doing some giveaways, doing some more PvP. And I'm also going to be recording it and putting it on YouTube so you will get to be in a YouTube video. That'll be super cool. I've released my t-shirts. Bam! Pop them up on screen now. Two awesome designs which you can get in hoodies, jackets, jumpers, um, um, normal t-shirts, high quality t-shirts, mugs, iPhone cases, a ton of products. And they're super cool. I'd greatly appreciate it if you could support my channel and my servers by buying yourself a Hadescraft t-shirt or buying yourself a Hades Productions t-shirt. Anything helps. It is all greatly appreciated. So check that out. Be on for the live stream. You can even follow the live stream now to make sure you don't miss it. Chuck the video a like. Subscribe and I'll see you next time.